bullshit charge. You came through. The money you had, and you didn't have to. You came through, you know, bailed me out. Information. Okay, good, I'm listening. Well, it's gonna cost you. It's gonna cost me. I was simply offering you a business deal. I have information that could help you, and I would like to be paid for this information. All right, what if I had a little something on the side? I paid for it. I used my own money. I'm a man. It's my duty to take care of me. If my wife did her job, I wouldn't have to. And if she took care of me, I wouldn't be here with you. And I wouldn't have to pay to take care of me and pay you to find out who she's taking care of instead of me. Right? We can't be seen in public together. You know that. And what do we have to talk about? Can't be done in a public place. Over a phone that could be wiretapped. We can't sit around in a car, looking like we're doing something bad, and a cop pulls up and sees us, checks our ID, and bam! Right now, a police report. Okay. We're drinking in a car. All right, I get it. Yeah, they got a guitar somewhere. Located in Beverly Hills. You know, maybe I can go out and fly out some tires and some big wigs, and maybe that speed up things on that Kyrie path. Well, how much would I know how to pay you? I'll tell you. Okay, go ahead. 50,000. That's a lot of money. Yes, but once I tell you what I know, then, then you'll know that I gave you a 50% discount. I'm saving you 50,000 bucks here. <laughs> Fuck you! You didn't do shit! If they were really your client, they wouldn't come back on your job to buy a new car from me. Listen, listen, you owe me. Fuck you. I'm not afraid of you. I don't give a fine fuck. I'll fuck you up! So we're going to do lunch? Yeah, you're hungry? Like a fucking horse. Good. How's uh, Gaspasio? I'll be fine with a Big Mac. But just to show you I like you, we'll do that. Gaspa fuck you. Gaspatios. Yeah, that's what I said. Let's go. But all I did was sell a car. You're taking all this personal. We need to find a man who knows how to bend the laws to me ways. And I too will be free. Sit back and watch. As I crush the spirit of the truth and suffocate it with greed. Watch how gold will rule the world. I trusted you. I never told you you could trust me. Now come on, let's settle up. I'm the dad. Okay, okay. I've heard enough. You didn't have to say why I'm the dad. Are you finished with your self-righteous crap? I may look like a fool or seem to like a jerk or an asshole, but one thing I'm not. And what is that? Stupid. I am not stupid. Where are you going? I'm going home. To kill myself. Mm -hmm. You've been in real world conflicts. Mine wasn't shit in the Marine Corps compared to yours. It was nothing. Good. I never liked you anyway. Mr. Do Good. Mr. Nice Guy. Mr. Honesty. Mr. Sincerity. We don't need guys like you. I did what I had to. You weren't here, so I did what had to be done. I closed the sale. <laughs> and then day in the kitchen a few months ago and I was kissing your feet, you just didn't get it. I started crying. My brother thought I was joking around. I'm not joking around. Because the things I've survived in my life was because of your example. To survive any friggin' adversity. I do it through your example. I made it happen. While you were at the beach with some bimbo, I closed the deal. So go ahead, kill yourself. You're nothing but a loser. In this world, you have to be willing to do what you have to. You can't let feelings get in the way. It's not about trust. It's about closing the deal. You're nothing but a loser. In this world, you have to be willing to do what you have to. You can't let feelings get in the way. It's not about trust. It's about closing the deal. You're just a stupid putz. Or almost a loser guy. Yeah, baby. Hey, Mr. Dagger. You're gonna make a great actor. You got this no shit fit thing going for you. Yeah, we got disconnected. Yeah, some jackass from the phone company was just in here. Oh yeah? You're gonna make it. Nothing will stop you. Screwing around with the wires. Yeah, I'm sorry about that. So, why don't you come on down and we can go over some numbers. You think so? I know so.
worry. I got you covered. <laughs> So I figure, if you knew the number that you could have gotten, then you could go back, lick a few butts, maybe suck a few dicks, then you could get that shitload of money for your client and your large ass commission. And voila, I get 50,000 bucks. <laughs> cool, huh? <laughs>